Good morning, dear friends. How many of you are feeling overwhelmed this morning with all that's going on in the world? Our hearts are broken. There's so many people that are suffering and going through such a difficult time. The Lord brought a, a scripture to my mind. Psalm 46, 1 through 3. God is our refuge and strength an ever-present help in trouble. Therefore we will not fear, though the earth give way and the mountains fall into the heart of the sea, though its waters roar and foam and the mountains quake with their surging. I'm reminded of a couple of months ago when I was so overwhelmed about Daisy having cancer. And when I woke up that morning, there was a bird singing outside the window. I've thought about that many times since, and I never have heard a bird singing outside of the window except that one time when the Lord inspired this poem. How can it be the sun arose just like it always does. The birds are at the feeder making a cheerful buzz. The sky is blue, the trees are green, the breeze is all around. How can it be that nothing's changed, but my heart is feeling down? Last week it was normal, at least at the start. Then some, something happened suddenly that took away my heart. Live each day to the fullest, we're told time and again, but we're never ready when things come to an end. The things so important yesterday are not important now. How do I motivate myself? Keep moving forward somehow, one foot after the other is what it has to be. No matter what we face in life, God says to follow me. And then there's another scripture. <laughs> you hear the horses. Psalm 61 verses 1 through 3. That's a song. <clears throat> hear my cry, O God, Attend unto my prayer. From the end of the earth will I cry unto thee. When my heart is overwhelmed, lead me to the rock that is higher than I, that is higher than I. For thou hast been a shelter for me and a strong tower from the enemy when my heart is overwhelmed lead me to the rock that is higher than i that is higher than i know that the Lord is with us no matter what our hearts our hearts are broken for all who have lost so much do what the Lord shows you to do in this world that's suffering in so many ways choose to be kind share God's light with the world in every way that you can you be blessed today. I will talk to you later.